everything and just like uh, just discomfort since two years. So advice endoscopy. Endoscopy like uh, just introducing into the mouth and see the uvula, the epiglottis, the vocal cord. And just if you go behind the vocal cord, we'll be entering the esophagus. Very form force, huh? Yes, follow me. Bring you. Bring bring it. Yes. So it's a upper esophagus. It's a middle esophagus where you can see the cardiac pulsation. The lower esophagus where the esophagus and stomach will join, like that's a esophagic junction. That is around 38 centimeter. It's, it's a little bit lax. OG junction like high lax. Go inside this uh, stomach. So it's the body of the stomach. I'm just going to the antrum. Drum. You can see the pyloric opening. I'm just entering the pyloric opening. You can see the beyond the first part. The first part looks a little bit like there is a nodule like structures. There is inflammation of first part. You can next is like we just entering the second part of the urno. So second part of the urno is normal. The antrum looks inflamed. And like this same susra of stomach, like I'm just going to do a J and O. You can see the fundus of the stomach. Fundus of the stomach, mild inflammation. Hiatus, we have to look for. And looking. Self classification. Three. See the body also inflamed here. So when we are coming out, deflate the stomach. Let's see the esophagus again. You can see like something missed out. See the upper esophageal ulcer somewhere here, like uh, on the 3 o'clock position, this part wrong. Right to the pharynx. Yes. Right, so. Yes. Can you see the 6 o'clock? That's the upper esophageal ulcer. That is like near the trichopharynx. You can see the inflammation and the like mucosal erosion. Okay. So this is the reason for his chest discomfort. Hmm? Chest discomfort. So, Prajima, Prajima, just like I'll go for a yeah. <laughs> In narrow band imaging, just to differentiate the research from anything. 